Hey everybody, it's Dr. Sam Robbins. Now, recent research shows that your brain can actually thin out and start to dissolve as you age. Specifically, overweight people with diabetes see the cortex, the brain, shrivel up in regions responsible for everything you need for your day-to-day -day functions, including the parts that control memory, movement, vision information processing, and even just going to the bathroom. Now, what the scientists have discovered, the cause of this tissue paper shrinkage is excess blood sugar, which can basically rush through your brain and rot out everything it touches. Now, overweight diabetics have the highest brain shrinkage. However, pre-diabetics and most people who tend to have higher blood sugar levels are also negatively affected and thus will have faster brain shrinkage as they age. Now, in a previous video, I also mentioned that Alzheimer's is now classified as type 3 diabetes adding more evidence that high blood sugar negatively affects your brain function. Now, the good news is that you can reverse this and at the very least, definitely slow the progression of any brain shrinkage due to high blood sugar levels. And there's three simple steps. The first is your diet. You need to basically reduce or eliminate all sugars, including fruits. Also, lower your total carbohydrate intake, such as um, breads and pastas, rice and grains. Stick to lower glycemic index carbohydrates, such as legumes, yams, and lots of vegetables. Also, add in healthy fats into your diet, such as raw nuts, uh, avocados, macadamia nut oil, seeds, coconut oil, and also fish oil. And also, increase your fiber intake, which helps prevent blood sugar spikes. Next, you want to exercise. You need to move daily. Exercise improves your insulin sensitivity, and the more muscle you have, the better your body will utilize the glucose and sugar and thus lower your blood sugar levels. Try to lift weights three times weekly so you can gain or maintain your muscle mass, and also go for a walk as often as you can. And third, you want some herbs and vitamins. Now, there's a handful of supplements that are clinically proven to help lower blood sugar levels and improve insulin sensitivity. Uh, herbs such as uh, cinnamon extract or alpha lipoic acid and chromium and bitter melon extract, banaba extract, and about a half a dozen vitamins and minerals. Now, under this video, I've got a link to the list of all the best performing supplements, including the correct dosages, forms, and so forth. So make sure you take a look. Now, by improving your blood sugar levels, not only will your brain cognition improve, but you'll also dramatically slow down the aging process. And another benefit to lower blood sugar levels is lower body fat, especially that stubborn belly fat. Well, that's it for today. I hope this video gave you more clarity. If you liked it, please subscribe to this channel because I've got some really cool exclusive videos coming out soon. If you found it helpful, please share the health with others so they can benefit as well. Also, do me a favor and please leave your comments and questions below. And most importantly, do yourself a big favor and take a look at the links below uh, this video for simple and proven ways for lowering your blood sugar levels naturally. As always, thanks for listening and have a happy and healthy day.